Hey, this is Ben at the Fiddler's Green Music Shop in Austin, Texas. We are an all acoustic stringed instrument shop and uh, we specialize in mandolin and mandolin family instruments, among other things, ukuleles and guitars and all kinds of things. But we wanted to take a minute to answer a question that we get a lot from our customers. And what is the difference in all of the mandolin family instruments? Um, so right now what I'm holding is a mandolin. And then right here we have a mandola, right here we have an octave mandolin, we have a bazooki, and a mandocello. So uh, the differences are, the if you think in terms of violin and violin family, the violin and the mandolin are similar and they're tuned similar and are tuned the same and they have, uh, they're in the same octave. So they're tuned G, D, A, E. Mandola would be like a viola, and that's tuned to fourth lower. That's tuned C, G, D, A. Okay? An octave mandolin is kind of what it sounds like. It's an octave lower than the mandolin. So G, D, A, E, but one octave lower. Similarly, the mandocello is an octave lower than the mandola, thinking still in violin terms or violin family terms, this would be a cello, and you got C, G, D, A. And last but not least, the bazooki is traditionally a Greek instrument that sometime in the 70s, uh, Irish musicians turned it into a rhythm instrument and started tuning it like a huge mandolin. Uh, we have this one uh, tuned in the uh, traditional Greek format, which is CFAD. And also, uh, something unique to a bazooki is that it has octave pairs on the two bass strings, so kind of like a 12 string guitar. So we have a high C and a low C, and a high F and a low F there. And uh, if you tuned it like a mandolin, that would be a G and a D. Um, and some people will tune those, or, or put unison strings on them and make it more like a long scale octave mandolin. But generally what we think about an octave mandolin is a shorter scale instrument. Um, it's not really standardized. There's different, uh, different scale lengths of an octave mandolin. Uh, but it's usually shorter than what we consider on a bazooki. Uh, so I'm going to play just a little bit on each one of these so you can get an idea of the sound. So this is the mandolin. fingerings, but it's going to sound different because it's a different key. And then the octave mandolin. This octave mandolin is by a great local builder named Micah Bruce, by the way. We're really glad to have his instruments. scale octave mandolins because I can play all of the things that I can play on mandolin on this instrument. When I move something to or move to something the size of a mandocello, I get pretty limited with the reach, um, although it's really fun to play because it's a big huge sound. cello and then last but not least the bazooki and since this one is tuned to the Greek bazooki tuning this is also if you're a guitar player this is relatively the same string to string as the treble four strings of a guitar um, so if you just omitted these two bottom strings you wanted to play a G you know you just play that string
bazooki. So there you go, mandolin family instruments. Have a great day.